Hey guys, we are getting loaded up, getting ready to head down to Pass Christian, Mississippi. Check out this load we got going here. We're gonna have 300 aqua blocks stacked up in there, 18 centipedes, and three snorkel vaults for the wetland. It's gonna be a load as we get the rest of this loaded up. We have arrived down here outside of Gulfport, Mississippi, and we're getting ready to do a big build today. We got us a little small cottage to hang out in this week as opposed to a couple of weeks ago when we were up in uh, Knoxville we are camping out. Today we're going to head up the road to Pass Christian, Mississippi and we're going to sit there and put a bog wetland filter in. It's going to filter out a natural bottom pond. I think it's about a half acre. But when we get on site we'll get in there and show you all about it. David, you ready to go? We're ready. Good morning guys. We're in Pass Christian, Mississippi today. We're getting ready to get started on a big wetland filtration. Check out what we got here. We got the underlayment. We got centipedes. As far as the eye can see, that right there is going to be 300 aqua blocks put together. Down here we've already started getting some stone. Get three inch pipe. Got some stone here. Gravel already been delivered out a little bit. There's going to be a lot more coming in. Yeah, got a few things of cobbles over this way here is going to be a big wetland filtration right there we have our natural pond already dug and filled we'll be draining it back down and putting underlayment in it later we have a wetland filtration it's going to come out with a little waterfall stream meandering down uh, a couple of drops coming down the other side of the little boardwalk there then on the other side is where we will have our intake skim cove. We'll be over there on that side, just on the other side of that sand. Over in there will be a little intake bay. It'll come in. Pipes will be buried underground there. And then over in this area right here, about where the blue tarp is just below it, we'll have another wetland filtration. From there we'll have a little pool of water. The kids can splash, play in. And then it'll drop on down to another little waterfall on that side. It's gonna be an exciting project. It's gonna take us probably about a week week and a half we're looking forward to it from the house there they're gonna have a pretty awesome view of the waterfalls coming down there i got the little sand beaches ready so set tight hold on all right guys are getting started here putting the aqua box together It'll be a full day here probably doing this i don't know somewhere around there how many aqua blocks do we have bubba there are 300 aqua blocks I think 290 of them are what's called for here on this project. So we will get them, get them put together and get them in. Quick shout out to Splash Supply up in Pennsylvania for getting our liner down here to us on a last minute call. Becky is a lifesaver. Hey guys, we're back out here on the job here in Pass Christian. Day six, sometimes life throws audibles at you and you just gotta adapt and overcome. Well, this one, you know, we got we got one that had didn't have a babysitter, so he had to come to the job site. And you can see him making the best of it. Well, that wasn't the worst part. Worst part is we got a little brother. Anyway, it's got a lot of stone. We've moved uh, 80 ton of gravel so far down there in the pit. Yeah, Darren and David, they're strapping some boulders up now, starting to put them inside the intake, or not the intake, but the bog. Well, a lot of work still to be done. It's gonna look pretty sweet when we're all done with this. But, well, I'll write you here later and uh, keep you updated. All right, guys, so today is day number eight of the working days. We finally got some, uh, Big equipment in. Got to get these stones up. We actually got to get our big water pump. There's our hoses and all that. 
We're just gonna put it on the pellet. But we got our old excavator back. But was working on getting some rocks right now. So take another video in a little bit. It's a water break time. Water break. Oh, somebody gets excited about water breaks. We are down here in the bottom of a pit full of gravel. As you can see, the levels have done come up probably two to three feet already of gravel. Because these are extensions added onto the snorkels now, so they're setting roughly six feet tall. So we're about three and a half feet of gravel coming up. Going to come up about another foot, foot and a half. Then we'll be ready to start putting some uh, boulders around the edges. What about it, guys? What you think, Josiah? You like it? And of course, we got the other supervisor riding in the excavator. Started filling the wetland up with the big pump back there. There it is in action. Making a giant ditch back there too. Look, already got a nice foot of water off that pond. It went directly into here, so. Meanwhile, we have Bubba doing some work on his phone. It's December 5th, and I got the boys some ice cold water because it feels like it's 90 degrees outside. Having a very confusing winter this year. Morning folks, we're here in Pass Christian, Mississippi. I think it's day 10 on this project so far. It come a rain last night, temperatures dropped 30 degrees. Went from 80 degrees and now it is 51 degrees today. We had some rain, it's gonna be a muddy, mess today probably i don't know still got a lot of stone making a little headway down here trying to get the pond drained down down there we got a little work we got to do in it starting to get the waterfall built up that way but it's gonna be a wild one today stay tuned Hey guys, Bubble Dreamscapes. We're out here in Pass Christian, Mississippi, still working on this project. I don't even know what day it is, but we've got underlayment here, rolls of it, and rolls there. We're coming down here to, gotta put underlayment across the bottom of the pond once we get it drained out. Right now we have a muddy, muddy mess. Last couple days it's been rain, slowly drying up. Got Dave and Darian over there seaming the, the bog to the stream. And they'll run a little seam tape across there and seaming that liner together. Not real sure how we're gonna get all this done. Slippery, muddy. Walking around here, I got the pond is coming on down. Normally you can see the level sets pretty much right there at the top of where that white pipe is. That's normally the top of where the level is. Get the bog finished filling up with the rain the other night. 